When is the right time to scale for growth? I mean, when do you start investing in people and technology? I think it's usually, with hindsight, six months before you actually do. So they say hindsight is a wonderful thing. So what can you learn from that? I think at the moment that you feel you have that inflection point where you can see the growth coming, you need to be able to see that three months ahead and start investing before it hits in order for you to really maintain that momentum of that growth. I think we, we, we knew when we were ready to scale up in marketing or to go abroad, the day we knew that our core business was steady, was stable, and was running without having us us having to focus on every single detail, every single second. When we had time to focus ourselves on developing the company in new ranges of products for new countries. I was very fortunate that my business was making revenue more or less from day one and it could grow and scale and I could put the money I made back into the business to scale it up. But different businesses might need money up front. So you've got to be great at doing a business plan, you've got to raise money. You know, I think you've just got to look at your unique business before you even go into business. Look, is the opportunity right for you? There's huge opportunities in technology. I think um, collaborating with customers is obviously very important. I think mobile and cloud technologies these days um, just, just absolutely place to that. You know, social channels, how you integrate your processes, you know, whether you've got a, an online web store, such as, you know, you could have Amazon Web Store or eBay, integrated back with, say, Sage 200 as a, as a mature ERP system. Having that integration, you know, is, it really helps you understand what, what your customers are doing, their behavior, um, and just gives you the insight that you need to run your business. From an investment perspective, if you've not got a good public online persona, if you've not got a fantastic website and good social media links, and if you're not doing this stuff and create, curating it carefully, you leave yourself at a big disadvantage compared to other businesses. Because the market now, it is not parochial anymore. It is, it is international, it is European, it is global. And get out there and, and be punchy and, and share what it is you're doing with people. That's a, a key component of growth. The UK is home to some of the most exciting, brilliant and ingenious businesses in the whole world. I get to write about these companies every day. I mean, I'm interviewing about 30 different people every week about the businesses they're building. And the stories that I hear make me really hopeful for the future of the economy. These stories are really exciting. I don't think we've ever had a more entrepreneurial time in this country. Um, there's never been more vim, vigour and, and drive to start companies and long may it continue.